my sister's somebody who always says she's seen ghosts and things like that. She's a bit weird, actually, in that sense. She's like, there's something weird in here. And my grandma was always, like, you know, reading people's tea leaves and all the rest of it. But I've never really seen or heard anything until... So last February, it was the anniversary of my little boy's um, death. So my little boy died seven years ago last February. And every year on his anniversary, we light candles and send balloons off into the sky celebrating his <coughs> birthday. So uh, this particular night, I'd got home late from work and I was eating. And next thing we hear, jumping up and down from Polly's bedroom. So I'm thinking, Polly's awake. She's, you know, I sent David up. David, go and see if Polly, tell her to get back in bed. He went up. So it's you, David yeah. and Emily. Emily. <clears throat> so he went up, opened the door, came down. He says, Polly's still asleep. I was like, oh, it's just, you know, covered on eating. Next thing we hear this jumping. It's like someone's jumping on so the floor spots. upstairs. Yeah. And then David went, Mum, look. And the chandelier underneath the room was shaking like this, like someone was jumping. So we're all a bit like, we go up again, she's still asleep, and come down. The next thing we hear, a child crying. <gasps> and it was not Polly. It was not Polly's crying. You know your own child's yeah, crying, yeah. don't you? It yeah. wasn't Polly. David's eyes came out on stalks, if they could get any bigger. <laughs> Emily was like, what is that? And we were all really freaked out. There's no other explanation for it. I went halfway up the stairs and it stopped and I opened the door and Polly was still fast asleep. Oh, oh, and we gosh. came down and it was Archie's birth minute at that oh. time we came down. And it was the strangest, weirdest experience that any of us have ever had, wasn't it? And there's no possible explanation and, for and it. And in a way, I bet you were pleased that, that Emily and David were there. Yeah. Because no one would believe you if you no. told. No, yeah. absolutely. Have witnesses there. Did you? Well. Not, did you? How, I mean, how did that leave you feeling? Did that give you comfort? Did you feel it was your little boy? Or did that yeah. scare you, that there, there was some <coughs> other presence in your... Well, your daughter's room. I mean, obviously, you're a bit like, that's really weird, but it did actually give us a lot of comfort. I think we all were a bit like, you know, this is, this is Archie, he's come to say hello and tell us he's OK. Yeah. So don't, forget, that... don't forget to send yeah. the balloons, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> send me balloons off, Mum, yeah. you're late. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, that, I mean, what's so powerful about that and so scary stroke amazing is that that was at the minute of his birth. Yeah. I know. For more Loose Women action, click here. And I'd subscribe if I were you. It's totally free and it means you'll be kept up to date with new videos and exclusive YouTube content.